Hey, this is Lana, the Comedian Medium. I'm going to bring you your love and relationship for June 2020. Please hit like and subscribe for a chance to win a free reading or hypnosis. Uh, you can also uh, visit my blog page, thewisewomansage.com. <clears throat> um, hit my description and you can see my website. I'm updating it as we speak. It's been a big pain. But, um, yeah. So, anyway. Um, here we go. Been a little bit uh, behind. I've been really busy. You guys are calling me a lot. So, um, I will respond to you guys within twenty uh, under 24 hours. Because I have my uh, devices on me all the time. And I just go, oh, yeah, call me up. Um, I'm going to be putting my, my, um, my, my, uh, calendar on there and upgrade dating that. Um, some other things is, let's see. Um, I'm going to be putting some more, um, things. Um, I have a connection to a very good friend who has a website. It's infinite soul vibrations. She's selling jewelry, like things. She makes me things like this, like one of a kind wraps. Yeah. Pure copper, by the way. Um, also, there's things you can buy. I'm in the process of making a new logo. It has to do with my little pigs because I get a lot of people requesting my pigs. So, and I'm like, yeah, because it's one of my spirit animals. I've got about eight of them. But anyway, let's get on with this. I also had somebody else um, that made a comment about my, um, my table. And sorry if there's like stuff on it. It's because I'm a painter. So I'm an art teacher and a painter so sometimes there'll be a little paint on here a little paint over here hey deal with it As what i do here is literally if you came to my house you'd be sitting here and we'd be doing a reading and that's literally what i'm doing that's why this isn't high tech so just let you know all right loving relationship Well, all right. This is love and relationship, but there's money involved also. So this is for my Scorpio. I feel like the, there's a 30-day here. There's a 30-day thing going on. Um, where somebody's returning or somebody's coming back or something's opening up to allow you to go forward. But there's money involved. See, look, at there's money, there's money. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of money involved in this one, even though it's a love and relationship. It may be the fact that you may be teaming up with somebody. Maybe you're moving in. Maybe somebody that is connected to you romantically, there's money. And maybe there's, it looks to me, there's jobs. Now, here's a, here's a, a relationship card. There's love and relationship right there. Now... You're going to be meeting somebody and you're going to be finishing something else out. Okay, there's an end here. Um, it could be just getting back to normal after this lockdown from COVID. Um, that has to do with, and the, here's, a, here's another card that can be romantic. I always think of it as romantic because it can be a relationship. The traditional relationship. Going back to normal. Going back to your nine to five relationship. It's a traditional relationship, okay? So maybe you've decided to make a committal, a uh, commitment of some sort, all right? Now, you'd gotten your wish in the past. You'd gotten your way, even though where things were a little hidden, you know? And you're trying to pick up pieces, trying to pick up pieces in your life. Now, it looks to me that there's a, there's a thing about money coming towards you, okay? Um, and like I said, this could be that so your your lover, your your husband, your spouse, your your the one coming into your life is connected to money, okay? So, and I do know that if you're gonna know what I'm talking about in 30 days. Now I'm reading this in mid middle of May, so you should know what I'm talking about by middle of June. Okay, and you're making plans, you know, because these are all overall themes. You're, you know, there's much to accomplish. There's more to do, and you're looking forward to it. 
And like I said, there's a job involved, a career involved, a change involved, money involved. Um, taking, I feel like there's pressure coming off of you. So <clears throat> I know this seems more like mostly like money, but when you've been down and out and you've been worried and that's on your mind, that's going to be what pops up a lot. But I do say it's something to do with somebody involved in your life with money. So I want to say for some of you guys, there may be like an ex that's giving money, may, that, that's coming. I, I want to say the overall theme of this month for a lot of you is coming back, returning. There's some returning going on, okay? Um, there's been some worry, and we all know that. There's worry, and there's a person in power right here. A person in power, it's a woman. Uh, she's an earth sign. So, you know, uh, uh, no, it's an air sign. Sorry. I'm looking again. I'm thinking, um, an air sign. It would be a Aquarius, Aquarius, Gemini, and I believe it's Libra. Okay. It's one of those. Okay. No Virgo. Yeah. Anyway, I'm trying to think. I'm trying to meditate on these cards. Um, because I, I, I tell people I don't necessarily need cards. When I read for you and you call me, I talk to your family. So they give me ideas. And, and usually I'll connect with a family. And sometimes, uh, recently I got one. They didn't know who they were. And they had to look them up. They have to actually call one of their parents and found out who I was talking about. Because they found out it was a great-grandparent. And I'm getting lots and lots of great grandparents because I think they've all been through this COVID thing before and they understand and they're there for support. So it's so like, like I said, I'm going to lay another deck of cards. This is authority. There had been authority, you know, like maybe your car, you know, you weren't allowed to see somebody. Maybe you had to sequester yourself. It sucked. I mean, and you were just about getting your act together. Prosperity. You were getting your act together and I'm like, oh my God. Well, now you're, the foundation is being there. So just, just be patient, you know. Your third eye chakra is active. That means you're, you know, you're using some of your intuition. And you're in the process of making a, a patient, planned choice. Okay? And it's telling you, too, to choose wisely. So, like I said, there's somebody coming back in your picture. I, I just really, really feel this really strongly. You know, plan it 